Well, the open source um, algorithms and beta tend to lag the closed source by six to 12 months. Um, but so that, so that, but given the rate of improvement, that there's actually therefore quite a big difference between the, cl the closed source and the and the open. Um, if things are improving by a factor of let's say five mm -hmm. uh, or more, um, then being a year behind is you're five times worse. So it's it's a pretty big difference, and that might be actually an okay situation. Um, but it, it certainly will get to the point where you've got open source um, AI that can do. That, that will start to approach human level intelligence will perhaps succeed it. Um, I don't know quite what to do about it. I, I think it's somewhat inevitable, inevitable that there'll be some amount of open source and I, I, I guess I would have a slight bias towards open source because uh, at least you can see what's going on. Whereas closed source, you don't know what's going on. Now, it should be said with AI that even if it's open source, do you actually know what's going on? Right. Because if you've got a gigantic data file and um, you know, sort of, Billions of, da of, of data points or weights and parameters. Uh, you can't just read it and see what it's going to do. Uh